materials shown here are the recommended ones to use because it will make the home stronger. This will last longer and save you money in the long run. So try to follow the toolkit as close as you can with what you can afford. Corrugated sheeting. There are different shapes and styles of sheeting you can use, but thicker galvanized sheeting such as 0.47 mm is the recommended because it is stronger and you can cover more surface area. This means you need less support beams in between the side panels and you can save material. Thin sheeting might be cheaper, but this will break easily and cost you more to replace sheeting again. Timber. The recommended timber is 38 mm by 114 mm South African pine. This timber is suitable for all homes and makes the structure strong and steady. If you are on a smaller budget, you can also use 19 mm by 109 mm timber thickness, but then you will need more support between the structures. The timber is cut into the required length and also secured with the top screws instead of nails for more durability. Fasteners. The recommended way to fasten the roof or sheeting to the beams are with the top speed screws and bond washers to achieve durability and watertight seal. There is no need to pre-grill the holes in the sheeting as the screws are self-drilling. Flashing is used to secure the corners of the home. This seals it off from the wind and rain to prevent damage and rotting to the framework. It also seals all the gaps to prevent fires from spreading easily.